you're bad. Okay, you're good. Um, thanks. Well, at long last, I've finally found the time to make this, my second Q&A. Sorry for the delay, it's hard to find the time when my house is quiet enough to keep recording. Just like last time, if you submit any questions into either submission video, they'll be answered now. So just sit back and relax or cringe at my terrible voice. Hey everyone, my name is Tyler Bernardo Boy, and this is my second Q&A. Big Boy asks, will this video have the highest sk count yet? Oh, wait, what? Was that one guy who dislikes your videos actually you all along? No, it wasn't. I never found out who it was. I had some suspicions, but I never got to confirm them. In Xenoblade X, do you dress your characters up seriously, or are you the kind of guy to put everyone in swimsuits or school uniforms? For most characters, I tend to use fashion gear to keep them in their original outfits, since those are the ones I think they look best in, and I'm just unoriginal. But for my avatar, I have him in the armor of the highest HP ordinance. But again, I use fashion gear to make him look like this. And yes, I call him Shelby. What voice did you use for your Xenoblade X characters? True to his name. Sorry, I'm all out of mercy. Sorry, it's you or us. We are number one, but every one is replaced with a question and answer from the first Tide Nider Boy QA. Man, that's another we are number one video to consider in the future. Where do I get the feeling someday I'll be the only one keeping the meme alive? Did you know that Phoenix Wright is in a fighting game and that he is my main in said fighting game? Oh yes, I most certainly did know that indeed. And I hope he gets into the sequel, despite the fact that I'd only get it if it was on the Switch. However, I didn't know you mained him. Nice, always great to find another Ace Attorney fan. Admiral Octopus asks, what game are you anticipating the most from 2017? Ah, I'm worried the answer to this could be potentially obvious to some people, so let's make this more interesting. Let's make this a top 5! Aren't you guys lucky? A countdown video within a Q&A. Hmm, but to do a top 5, we need to make this look stylish. Uh, not really what I had in mind, but hey. Welcome to Ty's Top 5 Most Anticipated Games of 2017. Number 5. Fire Emblem Warriors. Ever since Hyrule Warriors, I always wanted this to exist, and now it does. Number four, Fire Emblem Echoes, Shadows of Valencia. Oh boy, this looks awesome. It has the potential to beat Fates and Awakening, and I've always wanted the classic to be remade in 3DS Fire Emblem style. Number three, Super Mario Odyssey. <laughs> what can I say? This looks like a mixture of Mario Galaxy and Mario 64, my two favourite 3D Mario titles. And Mario can spin dash. Bonus. Number 2. Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. This game just looks plain amazing, definitely a game that will keep you busy for hours. And my number 1 most anticipated game of 2017 is... 1, 2, Switch Zelda Chronicles 2. My goodness, it's a cliched phrase, but this is a dream come true. A sequel to my favourite game of all time. When I first saw the trailer, I didn't think it was a Zelda Chronicles game at first. Yet I was still hyped. That's how good it looked. Then I saw the no pond. Cue my video. Just the art style, the music, the environments. This guy's flipping face. Everything just looks so good. Are you aware of the existence of Silver Gunner? And if so, what is your favourite high quality rip? Yes. And either Ocarina of Time boss battle number one, or the number one Hammer Brothers theme from Mario Brothers 3. But I did also like his Zelda 2 reveal trailer rip. It was actually really good. I was expecting more jokes, but instead what I got were two genuinely fantastic remixes. Are you planning on getting a Nintendo Switch at launch? At a later date, or do you have no plans with the system? I'll get it on release day if I can, but if not, I want to get it as soon as possible. It's George 4 asks, uh, You still haven't fixed that grammar issue. What are your opinions on 2016? Hmm. Honestly, for me, it was really good. Mikey asks, Are you a skilled boy? Well, I can be any fox if that's what you're asking. Is Melee your favourite? <laughs> melee? 
We all know the best competitive fighting game is Street Pass Quest. Who do you main in Smash? Sonic. But lately I've been playing in my secondary Shulk quite a bit. Speed and jump combos are great. Zeno Esquire asks, Has anyone really been far, even as decided, to use even go want to do look more like? Isn't that a meme? And I'm pretty sure they probably have by now. Ah, uh, here we go again. Nathan Wellings asks, What's red and smells of blue paint? Well, thinking about it, all paint smells pretty much the same, so something that smelt like blue paint but was red would just be red paint. How many flavours are you able to taste? What? I don't have hypergusia. Who's your favourite son? I'm not married, and I'll probably never have children, so I can't really answer that. KRG asks, Do you have a favourite song from the Sonic series? Oh yeah, most certainly. Almost Dead by Power Man 5000. No way, that song is trash. Hmm, probably Live Life, the ending theme of Sonic and the Black Knight. It's a really nice song. What's your favourite song in general? Huh. That's a good question. Hmm. It's just now occurred to me that I have never sat down to think about what my favourite song in general is. Hmm. I only really listen to video game songs, so... Beyond the Sky, the ending theme of Xenoblade Chronicles comes to mind. So does almost anything from Xenoblade X. But it really depends on what mood I'm in. Actually, you know what? Stuff it. I have two. The DK Rap and We Are Number One. Is there a game genre you despise? And likewise, do you have one that's your favourite? I'm not a huge fan of first person shooters. They aren't really my thing. But my favourite will be open world JRPGs. So again, Xenoblade makes its way into this QA. Kind of boil this, giving me an absolute question overload. Dang. Right, let's get this over with. What are your views on mouses? Computer mouses? Well, I hate my old one. It died. Then some aren't sensitive enough, but now I... Oh, you mean mooses. Missing an S there. <laughs> I'm assuming this is because you always come into school, having randomly brought a pack of chocolate mooses, and you hand some to me. Yeah, they're nice. I do like me some chocolate mousses. What's your most memorable memory in school? Couldn't you just have said memorable moment? But anyway, I don't actually know. <laughs> Is it bad that nothing comes to mind? I guess school's just that unmemorable. Maybe the time when I got to do a speech on Sonic to the class, but I ended up spending half the time doing Sonic impressions to the class instead. What is your dream job? To be an animator, and make an anime starring my characters. What's your favourite food? Oh, how generic. Um, roast pepper pig. What's your favourite lesson? Robbie Rotten's lesson in trickery that's going down in history. What were your GCSE results? Why do you want to know that? Well... They weren't at all low, I'll say that much. Can you show a collection of your drawings? Uh, why the heck not? I guess I can show a few of my favourites. Rabbi E asks, When will you do a reaction video to Hair Cake? When it stops being rhyme time. But it's always rhyme time. What happens at the end of All My Sons? Huh. I don't know. But there's only one way to find out. Ah, oh, here we go. Joe Keller says BRB KMS. 
solve log 2 open bracket 2x plus 1 close bracket minus log 2 open bracket x close bracket equals 2. Mathematics? Really? Back in a sec. X equals a half, I think. I stopped doing mathematics almost a year ago. Jack Shenston asks, any gameplay videos planned? There's some gameplay in the background of this video, but when it comes to a dedicated gameplay video, I need to get around to playing Sanic 2 sometime. I think you asked me for that a while back. Are we going to see an updated rig video with more kicking Wii peripherals? Perhaps, since I do have more tech now and more peripherals to kick. Are you a, a real villain? To that I have to say... Nah, nah. Can you go to the Australian market and get free fonts? <laughs> yes, I can. Can you order me a copy of Mus Mus Gus Mus Thrus? <laughs> it is on the way as we speak. Chris Miller asks, What would you like to achieve on YouTube by the end of 2017? Hmm. Wait, you're the one who always sets me subscriber targets. As I said in my last Q&A, I don't have goals on YouTube. Do Japanese people do Japanese people speak Mandarin? No, Mandarin people speak Mandarin. Can this be the last question? So tempting to put another question after this one. And there we have it. That's all the questions I received, and so we've come to the end of my second Q&A. If you liked the video, please share some, please share some comments. I won't ask for much else. Also, leave some suggestions for future videos if you wish. It always helps. Well, I think that's about everything. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.